WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Well, we start to turn the page to the month of March, and it's still 20 days out from spring, and a little bit of a freeze play here for Mother Nature as we get towards tomorrow, because we've been to the month of March, and we're still dealing with wintry weather around here in Central Maryland, Western Maryland, and also down the Eastern Shore. Winter weather advisories are in place from 10 p.m. tonight right on through 10 a.m. tomorrow morning. For one to three inches of snow expected and most of that is going to come in here before the early morning commute and that's why we're going to see some problems across the region with travel delays on the high side of things and also school delays for many areas and even the possibility of some closures that's going to be on the high side of things because the snow is coming in before the sun comes up and that's a prime time period during the month of march for snow to stick to the surface area of low pressure off to the south across portions of West Virginia as well as eastern portions of Kentucky on the northern end of it. It is frozen precipitation. That's what we get into tomorrow morning on the southern side of it. It's more of the liquid form of things in the form of some heavier rain showers and that frontal boundary. You can actually see it here on the temperature map. There's a nice gradient showing up and this is actually the placement of where the jet stream is right now and this is going to waffle back and forth from the coast inland as we go through the next couple of weeks of March here. So where that storm track does set up in the coming weeks ahead and if we have cold air available, of course, we could see more snow and ice events across much of the region and it all starts tomorrow. The snow comes in overnight tonight. It'll arrive by midnight off to the west and then overspread the area early tomorrow morning. Four or five o'clock will be in light to moderate snow for a brief period of time. There could be a heavier band that sets up somewhere around the I-70, I-270 corridor out towards Frederick County and then things will begin to taper as we roll through the day. Notice the temperature slowly but surely coming up. And as we get towards the afternoon hours, it's more of a drizzle and some light flurries mixed in with a couple of sleep pellets at times. That will carry us through early Saturday morning before the system quickly departs us by late Saturday morning into the afternoon. Then the sunshine will come back out and temperatures will be back towards 50 degrees. So that's the good thing here in the month of March. You can get snow on one day and it could be all gone the next one to two inches of snow down towards Annapolis as well as Kent Island back up to the Chestertown area all the way down towards Cordova across portions of Caroline as well as Talbot and even Kent counties over to Anne Arundel County and then further north and west of the city. If you're along I-270 or even back up here along US-15 as well as Maryland 30 up towards Manchester and Lineborough or I-83 north going towards Parkton. You have a better bet at getting in on the two to four inch amounts, especially up in the higher terrain towards the Catoctin Mountains. A better bet to see that four inch amount out of this storm system. 29 degrees, increasing clouds, snow before dawn. Light snow tomorrow morning will give way to a little bit of that rain snow mix, and then it will slowly start to taper as we get towards the evening hours with temperatures in the mid to upper 30. Saturday's forecast kind of cloudy, a lull between systems there, and then we get towards the next weather maker. The question is, where does it go? Does it take the northern or the southern track? Southern track favors more snow. This is kind of what it looks like on the model. Right now, we're favoring towards the rain. As we get towards Monday, we could end out as snow. And then behind all this, cold what? temperatures in the 30s, 20s, and overnight lows in the teens. All right, here's my prediction. This is it. This will be it? our last I blast of winter. This after is we it. get through Monday, after we get through Monday. Right now, at least the long range models looking at everything, it's once we get past about March 15th, March 16th, it starts to go into our favor. Okay. Oh, so we could have more. We could have more. Mm, that's enough. Remember All last right. year, 6.7 inches. All right, All right. thanks enough. a lot, Eric. Love you. Clip his mic. All right, the world's <laughs> smallest 